Hi guys and welcome back again to the Tactic YouTube channel. Today we are going to do an unboxing of a completely new product from SteelSeries, the 9H gaming headphones. This is their top of the line product for this segment and the pretty steep price backs that up. SteelSeries products are quite popular among the gaming community and that's why you will see on the box some logos of the famous gaming teams like the Navi and Fnatic from Dota 2. In front of the box you will find the picture of 9 inch and on the back you can see a brief overview of the features like the Dolby Pro Logic and some accessories that go along with the headphones. Let's continue on with the unboxing of the headphones. For all of those using headphones for the first time, here are some user manuals inside this paper box. some cable and adapter goodies the headphone itself and the dedicated USB sound card the build quality is really good although you wouldn't say that at first the plastic housing around the outer shell and the top part of the headband have a rough and hollow finish. The earbuds are very comfortable and they easily adjust themselves to the shape of your head while completely covering up your ear. They have a nice orange stitching around the outside of the earbud. As we said earlier before, the top portion of the headband is made out of plastic inscribed with the SteelSeries logo, but the padding that goes on the head is really thick and soft. The extension part for adjusting the height and size of the headphones is made out of combined plastic and aluminium with a nice brushed finish and inscribed logo. The connected earbud shell can swivel around in all directions but with minimum travel distance. Overall, the 9H has a good quality build with some spare room for improvement. You will find the microphone on the left earpiece of the headphones neatly tucked away inside it. It is very easy to pull it out but somewhat hard to get it in back again. It contains two microphones, one for your voice and the other for ambient sound for noise cancelling purposes. Right beneath the microphone you will find a micro USB plug for the core connection. The USB sound card dongle has a dedicated micro USB connector as well as a separate analog microphone in and audio out 3.5mm jack. Be sure that you install it in the right spot where it doesn't hang out like this so you don't damage the USB cord over time. Basically you can choose between these two ways of connecting the headphones to the computer or you can use your own integrated sound card from the motherboard. You can control all the basic functions like the equalizer, Dolby headphones, microphone noise reduction via the SteelSeries engine software which you can download from their website. You will also get a couple of cables, one of which is this main cable with the volume rocker and a microphone mute button. The cables are pretty thin but they have a nice sleeve finish. Here is a 4 pin adapter for the mobile phones, but without that you will use it in that case, probably with laptops that have a combo 4 pin jack. And for the end, audio out and microphone in splitter for analog connection and one extension cord. Thank you once again guys for checking out the unboxing of the SteelSeries 9 inch gaming headphones. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you liked our video, leave a comment if you have any questions about the product. And of course, subscribe to our Tactic YouTube channel for more content like this, or you can just check out our other video unboxings from before.